This this is just incredibly freaking amazing right here. Was I not just talking about Janelle Bell two days ago? Well, here he is. He's he's here. He's on the screen. This is this is the first time I can remember actually seeing him speak. The most important uh, reason why TriMet cares about the disadvantaged business enterprises is uh, not only is it important for our social equity goals, making sure that when we're building uh, public works projects like the Portland Milwaukee Light Rail or the Interstate Project, which is where we got our DBE really foothold, but it's important uh, from a transit equity perspective because one element of transit equity is economic empowerment. And the best way we can do that is when we're building transit projects is to ensure that communities who have traditionally had uh, been underserved are really given opportunities in all the projects that we're building. Well, uh, that's Mr. Bell. Um, so, you know, for some, fu for some funny unknown reason, I thought that the Office of Transit Equity existed for riders, you know, people that use transit. Uh, silly me. I mean, it's... It exists for businesses, of course. You know, what, what's the matter with me? I mean, TriMet exists for business. That's what it's been doing since the advent of Fred Hansen. It's, it's gone from a transit agency from, for riders to a transit agency for developers and for business. And that's what Mr. Bell is doing in the office, apparently. He, his, whole, his whole $95, $100,000 a year job is to facilitate the contracts primarily the you know the boondoggle contracts mlr which is like you know this is this is the pot of honey the pot of gold this this is the free money coming from uncle sam you know it's it's the money that's everywhere it's 1.5 billion they, they whining about our our uh, unfunded liability our unfunded liability is less than the mlr but you see in the minds of the public the infant liability problem. MLR, no, not a problem. You see how you see how the reality of, of the world gets jumbled in people's minds. They don't put it together. Anyway, Mr. Bell is there for business. He's not there for minority riders. Stupid.